we want to find the marginal cost, marginal revenue, and marginal profit given that the cost function, that's the total cost function, is 10x squared plus 5,000 and the total revenue is 3x squared plus 6x minus 15. Now, given the marginal cost, no, um, given the total cost, is 10x squared plus 5,000. You know that we find the marginal cost by differentiating. So, C prime X, the derivative of CX, is <coughs> 2 tenths would be 20X. That would be it. Concerning the revenue now, the marginal revenue, R prime X, would be 3 to 6 X plus 6. Alright, that is that. So that's the marginal cost and the marginal revenue. What about the marginal profit? Alright, let's see something here. P prime X profit is revenue, which is 6X plus 6, minus cost, which is 20X. Alright? So I have 6X plus 6 minus 20X would be 6x minus 20x would be negative this would be negative what negative 14x plus 6 all right so that's the function for the marginal profit let's look at it another way you know that the total profit is the total revenue minus the total cost. Suppose we find the total profit, then differentiate it. What would happen when we find the marginal profit by differentiation? Let's see. So the total profit is the total revenue minus the total cost. So that would be what now? The revenue is 3x squared plus 6x minus 15. So remember, we're doing it again, but another way. Minus. The cost is 10x squared plus 5,000. They didn't ask us for the total profit, so we didn't do this the first time. But let's do it now and see. This is 3x squared plus 6x minus 15 minus 10x squared minus 5,000. Let's see what happened here now. Equal. 3x squared minus 10x squared plus 6x minus 15 minus 5,000 that would be minus 5,015 so we have 3x squared minus 10x squared with 7x squared plus 6x minus 5,015 so that now is the total profit p of x now, P prime of X, the derivative would be the marginal profit. So, two sevens, it would be negative. It's a negative here. Two sevens, 14. Where are it? 15 is 14. Differentiate this, would be plus 6. No, 14X plus 6. All right. So it's the same thing as what we did before. So what happened here? We found, we used differentiation, differentiated the total cost to find the marginal cost. We differentiated the total revenue to find the marginal revenue. And then subtracted 
the marginal cost from the marginal revenue to find the marginal profit. We didn't bother to find the total profit because they didn't ask us. The question didn't ask us to do that. But then I said, suppose they had asked us to do that. What would happen? The total profit would be the total revenue minus the total cost. So that's what we did here to find the total profit. Then found the marginal profit by differentiating the total profit and got the same thing as before. Alright? So remember now, total profit is total revenue minus total cost. Marginal cost is the derivative of the total cost. Marginal revenue is the derivative of the total revenue. You differentiate. And marginal um, profit is the derivative of the total profit.